everybody, this is Average Gamer Cruise Kaiju. Figure I'd take a moment, take a stop, and do a day, a quick fire morning in the life. It's Sunday, game day here in pretty much the whole Santa Clara County, what with uh, the Angry Bird Arizona Cardinals versus the Down in the Dumps San Francisco 49ers. Um... I don't know, it's just, I don't know, I don't know why the, all the hype is going around, especially since, I don't know, they're not really doing as good as anything. Currently, I mean, they're they're hoping to go out 8-8. Eight and eight. Anywho, beyond that fact, I mean, I, I mean, Christmas season's already over. I want to just figure I'd go over a quick overview of what I've been doing for these past two weeks. Um... I did pick up a title um, before it disappeared off the market. I'm pretty sure you guys may have heard of it, Marvel vs. Capcom Origins. Um, I'm, this, this time I'll probably be able to do another uh, Let's Talk series bit about it. Speaking of which, I still need to finish the other one, Grand Turismo. If you want me to finish that up, feel free to uh, comment below. I mean, I have the second. I just need to work on a good save file of it, or... Game Shark it, but Game Shark's a cheesy chicken way out. Um, so yeah, I'll probably be able to do a, a, a quick fire history history lesson of Street Fighter. Um, well, sorry, sorry, the um, sorry Marvel vs. Capcom. Actually, what am I saying? Because I know that was it. It all started with Marvel superheroes, which I have. But then I moved on to other stuff, which I don't have, so I'll probably have to outsource uh, multiple videos and whatever not. Um, if you guys want to do a few demo matches with us as well, that's cool and fine. We're going to be doing uh, uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 3 tomorrow, Ultra Ultimate. Uh, we'll be doing that tomorrow. Um, we'll also be doing Ultra Street Fighter as well, so feel free to check those out once the time comes. Um... Uh, once again, please, and, and once again, a quick recap of our events. Uh, we had a choice of going to Collision Course um, or Anime on Display, which we happily chose Anime on Display, which is going to be up in San Francisco. We do have an event link for that. I'll toss that right about yay, where my nail is. So here, um, I did create it. We did create an event for it, and tickets are moderately expensive. I would say roughly about. Thirty dollars for a day, or twenty dollars for a day, thirty, thirty, or twenty-five for a day, thirty-five for both days. But if you pre-register right now before uh, New Year's Eve, you get five dollars off the whole package, and then it gets better with the whole hotel hotel room deal, which is all good and fine. I don't really, we don't really need the hotel, or do we? <laughs> um, beyond that. So, uh, I believe we're going to be going out there because we, there are there is a gaming room over there, but I don't, don't know if it's a good idea, but I'll find out. I have to break out Luigi for that. I'm too tall. Um, I'm too tall for Mario. Anywho, uh, moving on from that, the next event in line that we are looking for, we're looking at least two months in advance, would be Rock Age. Rock Age, the big, the big, the big classic gaming festival, ar arcade cabinets. A couple tournaments out and about. Odds are I will be volunteering for this. Um, yeah, actually, I actually got a word from from uh, someone up top in the, for volunteering position. So shoot, you you might be able to see me, see me running an event or be a and runner. Yes, I said and runner. Don't look at me that way. So, a quick recap of what exactly it is. I mean, there are. There are multiple vendors out and about. There are multiple arcade machine cabinets all, all about. Uh, last year there was a Marvel vs. Capcom 1 machine out there, so I got a chance to play that. It was not on free play, but the rest of the cabinets were. But, the, but all the cabinets in there are free play, as long as you pay your entry. There are also various, various tournaments as well. Uh, 
I entered in uh, Mario Kart Double Dash. Um, Sma I think I didn't, no, I didn't make Smash Bros. last year. I did make Hydro Thunder, though, and that was a kick. I got second place. So who knows, I might end up running that tournament this year, but I'll find out. South Bay Button Mashers will also, will also be uh, appearing at this event. I've done a few cross promotions with them. They're a pretty cool cool set group. You should, you should check them out too. But um, I'll just put their link down below in the description. It's not too big. And then, hmm. Yeah, I suppose it's a quickie. I guess I suppose it's a little quick video that, I, that I've seen. Uh, that's pretty much it. Hey, uh, if... Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel. We do need it. We do need the subs. I mean, sure, sure, Facebook's all, all good. We're at 3.7k likes. Could be a little bit better. Actually, definitely could be better, but hey, we're happy with what we got. We're happy. And for those of you that have been with us for the whole ride, we thank you. And un until then, um,. Until then, I'm probably going to be doing a lot more videos for Arcade, being that uh, one of my gifts was pretty useful. You'll see why in a few. In a few videos, I should say. Anywho, alright, job at it, and see you guys in the next video, or online. I'll put our, I'll pay attention to Facebook, we do have our gamer tags on board. Ciao.